<gasps> oh my good god. I think we wrecked. Let's go, Barry. Go! Start it! We're on fire. We are on fire. Hey, you want some ice cream? I'm a lizard boy. I'm a lot lizard again. Welcome, hoarders. Here to be playing some more Mafia. The Death of Art. Which should be the last chapter well, in the game. Look at this. Christ has finally risen. I was getting ready to call the coroner. Sorry. Had a bit of trouble falling asleep this off. Me too. Thanks to you tossing and turning all night. Okay, what'd you do? Robbed a bank. You're just feeling lucky is all. Got that right, champ. I've been thinking. Oh, yeah? I'll call the papers. I've been thinking about taking you and a kid out to the shore. You serious? Ain't you working? Uh, Polly and me, we've come into some money. Huh. One of his cracked angles finally pay off? Yeah, something like that. Pack a few bags. I'll swing by after I go around to Polly's. What ain't you telling me, Tommy? Nothing. Sure, you and Polly are suddenly flush, and now you want to leave town for a few days? That don't square. What's the point of making a buck if we can't spend it? That ain't it. Look at you're fancy moving. cake mix. Even when you're standing still. Yeah, you're nervous about something. Polly, you don't even know why yet. But well, it must be it. Better figure it out before you get to Polly's. Just in case it's him that got you all wound up. <laughs> Polly's all right. Don't worry about it. Well, I guess I'll see you soon. Okay. Oh, there's the blue car that, uh, Nearly got me killed and got destroyed. What? This has pop-up headlights? That's fucking awesome. It's also a really fast car. Okay. I'm going to put the limiter on for this bad boy. I did just realize, because um, I just did the previous episode right before this, um, another thing that they didn't add was there's a mission for the last mission where you have to follow this, like, college teacher around to steal his car, and you're supposed to use that car for the robbery or something. I don't 100% remember why you had to take the car. I think it was for that mission, but on the remake, you don't even have to deal with that at all. Um, unless that's a, uh... No, that's a mission for the uh, mechanic. What is his name? Because I always forget it. It's... Should be right under the... Bertone's Automotive. Um, Polly's apartment's pretty far away, so I will see you guys when we get there. <gasps> oh my good god! I think we wrecked. Oh, you can flip it? Oh, that's pretty cool. That was one hell of a wreck. I didn't think I was honestly going fast enough for that to happen, but apparently... Okay, we're at Polly's. All we should have to do is honk. I remember this is where I had trouble before. This neighborhood's going to the dogs. What happened to your door? Christ only knows. Hmm. I may or may not have had an accident with my vehicle. Oh, we can just walk in this time. Before, it had some stupid glitch where you were supposed to honk, and sometimes it wouldn't work. Or no, that was for the bank job. Because he wasn't going to answer this time. Jesus. 
This this is one of those parts that really pissed me off the first time. Like it really gives you the anger to continue through the game. Folly. Oh, yeah, but what about the money? Torn a fucking skull. Oh, God. I was... I was calling to warn him. About what? Jesus Christ. I owe you fellas my life three times over. Warn him about what, Sam? Salieri. He found out about the bank job. You're in deep shit, Tom. You gotta disappear. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, I just need some cash to get me and the girls out of town. Can you swing that? Sure. Anything, pal. You want me to come to Polly's? No. No, I can't stay here. Uh, meet me at the, the city gallery. Yeah, okay. Keep your head down, Tom. Uh, I'll see you soon. And uh, thanks, Sam. I always pay my debts, Tom. You know that. I don't know. I I feel like I liked Polly. the original Polly I gotta go. and like the new Polly equally but different at the same time. If that makes any sense. I'm gonna call the cops. Like I but I like right. them both as characters, but they're so gunshots. different that it's weird. But I still uh, never mind. So we have to go to the city gallery. That is like in the middle island, I believe. Yeah, that's not too far away, but I'll see you guys when we get uh, to the front. Okay, we are just out front. Got to pull in this bad Larry. Oh, wow, no steering at all. It was just all understeer there. Um, I always do this with missions that I don't know if how I'm going to be leaving them um, because I like to have the car facing the correct direction because you never know. Don't move, Tom. Shit. Hey, Tom. Sam. And as I was going to say earlier, Sam, I hate yeah, him equally on? as both characters. That's why I said never Polly. mind. Put me in a bad spot. Because he's a cunt no matter what. I know, Sam, but I'm sorry about that, but I need to get out of town. Can you help me or not? There you go again. Making me choose between my friends and the family. This is what you were looking for, Polly's. Here's your cut. I don't know how that Morning broke apart start. like that. Sam. You killed him. You killed Polly. No. Polly got himself killed. And you seem real tore up about it. I'm just in a good mood. Things are right between me and the Don. I'm moving up. And I just found this big bag of money. Don knows about Frank, Tom. The whore, too. 
That whore. The girl you were sweet on. You're the one that let her live. Yep. I'm sorry about this, Tom. But our business has rules. Shame, Toe. Don Salieri really liked you. Guess we'll both have a good cry at your funeral. You think you're doing this because you're loyal, but you're not. You're just scared. Maybe. But you would have lived a lot longer if you would have just looked over your shoulder from time to time. Goodbye. Don't let him suffer, boys. He's my buddy. Fuck you. Here we go, guys. Gonna hang you out to try. Over here. He's on me. You can I shoot through that? No. I'm gonna try to take this slow. Now you're done. I'm gonna try to take it slow and I'm gonna try to use the least ammo possible. I'm glad I burned Where'd him up. Go, Sam? I hope there's more checkpoints to this because before, uh, it kind of was not very uh, entertaining to me. Where, oh, where are all the fucking guns? I feel like we went immediately up the steps a lot quicker this time than originally. Do I have... No, I don't. Business is business, Tom. I know that you, out of all of them, know that. What? Dude, like, there's so much shooting before you get to this point. No more, you Aw, oh, shit. Hey, over here! No one but you. Put them to sleep! I'll miss our talk back at the bar. Huh. Maybe I'm good to go up here. When you fuck with the boss, you fuck with us all. We're a good guy, Tom. We're a good guy. Oh, fuck this guy. Shame. Come on. <gasps> no. Come on. Box him in. Okay, got him in the head. Oh my. Sam, you bitch. It's all he ever was, all he'll ever be. He's a little fucking bitch. I thought that there was uh, a health thing up here. Unless that's downstairs. Is it? That doesn't make sense, because it showed a health thing, and now there isn't. Unless he used it, I don't know if he can or not. Oh no, it's still here. Take your bones, boy! Over here! Sorry, Tom! You do the same! You don't eat alone! It's one of the only rules we've got! Gotcha! Die, 
I want the Tommy gun very badly. Now, the upper rooms are pretty much the same as they always were. Fuck you, bud. Oh no. I don't want to be standing there. What I need is more ammo. Which means more guns. Oh, they got multibs. Okay, those doors are shut. We got ourselves a magazine. I only have 14 rounds left in this, which is not good at all. I don't see anyone up here. I need to run and get a place. Got him. Over here. I just wanted to shoot him so I'd have more ammo in my Tommy gun. Come on. Throw some flames! Warming him up! God damn it! See him? Right. That one didn't hit me, so we're good. I'm gonna reload while I can. That should be everyone that was in the immediate vicinity of the room. They're hitting me with these fuckers everywhere. Where is he? Breathe a little. Gonna drop you off the bridge. Did that hit him? I think it did. Burn that bitch. Gotcha. You're a dead man okay, more health. <clears throat> Probably could have been a little safer with that. But you do what you gotta. Why? Did he not have any ammo in that? If not, that's kind of upsetting. Get over here now. Fuck you, Sam. Save me some time. Come on. I, I'm sorry if I'm being a little too quiet for this, but I am... Come on. It's so annoying when they throw those. It really, really is. Ah, oh, he's over here. I don't think there's anyone else over here. Yeah, I know, Tommy. You're fucking sweating up a storm right now. Ah. Cover me. Have this. 
I think that was the right choice to make, honestly. That oh, he burned himself, dumbass. Where is he? I can't even hit him from there. Grabbing cover. You're in my sights. I don't think I am. Quite frankly. You bitch. Come on. Oh my Shit. damn. He doesn't know what to do. I'm Get ready to die. Gonna reload. It's fucking brutal. Okay, we got him, we got him, we got him. We're going checkpoint to checkpoint, and we're doing okay. How am I not getting any ammo for this gun? Fuck you, Sam! I know you do the same, Tom. Hell, I know you've done the same. I'm gonna kill him so much. I don't see anyone in here. Get over here now. I don't I don't see anyone. I'd like to get all the comic books I can get. All I have is this. This is not good. There's not good and then there's this. Oh my god. Dude. A fucking grenade. That is cheap as fuck. That ain't getting me this time. Thanks. I'm just happy I'm one shot in most of them. Sam, you're so fucked. He doesn't even know it yet. <laughs> I got him. A lucky shot, Tom. But the thing about drug money is it pays for a lot of muscle. Put him down, boys. <laughs> and there's like one guy left. Get up. Hey, hey. Get that ain't fair. He can move real fast. I don't think he's gonna die. Take this guy out. There we go. Come on. Got a Molotov. There we go. 
Might as well grab the shotgun. Get in cover. I didn't even know the guy was gonna be there. Glad I grabbed the shotgun. Okay, I wanna grab that fucking minigun. Tommy gun, whatever. Where is he? It says find him. He ain't up here, I'll tell you that. I see bloody hand marks all over. Can I fucking? Oh, I was trying to lean up against the wall. Yeah, yeah. However far you run, Salieri will find you. Willie? I think he ran off. I heard a grenade. I'm glad you bought yourself some more time. I really have. This ain't a fight you're gonna win. Bitch. <laughs> I fucked him up. Realistically, he'd already be dead. Nobody's carrying you to the doctor this time, Sam. You kill me now in the dawn. She's never gonna stop looking for you. But you let me live. I'll tell Salieri you're dead. You can disappear. Just like Frank. Only you'll be smart enough to stay gone. Right? What happened to him? He was hiding out in Europe. <laughs> the dumb bastard. She started betting at the dog track. Got spotted by a friend of the family. So Salieri... He sent out a crew. And his family? Can you? Always that little voice in the back of your head. Maybe sounds like your baby girl, Sarah. Always telling you not oh, to pull that trigger. Oh fuck you! Shut up. And you can't make up your mind. It's getting easier every time you open your fucking mouth. <laughs> we sure had some laughs, right? Remember that time? Me, you, and Polly. Fuck you. There you go. Do like ten more. Pick up that Tommy gun behind you and just empty the clip right in his head. I fucking hate Sam. He's a cunt. Those blood drops don't look that real. They look really pixelated. <laughs> it's not over yet, guys. Don't leave yet. I sympathize with the situation, Tom, and I want to help your family, but I can't do anything unless you're willing to testify in court. You understand that, right? You'll have to sit in that box, stare down Salieri, Ralphie, Vinny, maybe even Sarah's father. I. I don't know if you got the stones for it, if I'm being honest. I'll do what needs to be done. But you need to get my family new identities and ship them far away from here. Well, hold on. There's a long road between us sitting here bumping gums and Sarah sleeping under new stars. Then I'm sorry I wasted your time. 
And mine. I gotta get out of town. Look, Tom. I got a family too. Wife, four boys. All Irish twins. Yeah. So you know I understand what you're going through. All the worrying over them, the fear that one of them's gonna go before you do. But this case, it'll be one of the biggest this city has ever seen. It could drag on for years, and I don't know if I can protect you for that long, not the way things are downtown. Everyone's gotta eat, right? Even dirty cops. Just being honest here, I mean, there's a few bodies I can trust downtown, but not many. And if it comes down to you or me taking a bullet, I'm not gonna make my wife a widow. Keeping you alive ain't exactly the moral course, but I'll try. That's a pretty good sales job. Trying to make me think you got nothing on the line. But this is your whole career right here. However it works out for me, whether I live or die, you get to crack the Morello case and take down a Don. Celieri will be your legacy. Don't go thinking you know me, Tom. Salieri belongs behind bars. I'll help you so long as you help me put him there. That's all this is. Then that has to be enough. Nineteen fifty one. A long time ago, in another life, someone once told me that family is a man's Achilles heel, his greatest weakness. Maybe it was right. Because everything I've done, both good and bad, I've done for my family. I've turned my back on people they thought were my friends. I've kept a lot of hard promises. I spent eight years totally alone, trying to find myself so I could come home. A better husband. A better father. A better man. Now that I'm a lot older and just a bit wiser, <laughs> I see that family is our greatest weakness, but it's also our greatest strength. It gets us out of bed in the morning. It lets us chase our dreams, even when they're moving too fast to catch. It keeps us from falling over. When we're too tired to take another step. Mr. Angelo. Yes. Mr. Salieri sends his regards. And there was Vito. Tommy! That's okay. You're safe now. You're all safe. Remember that money, jobs, even best pals will come and go. A 
but family. Family is forever. Okay, well that is the end of the game. I was wondering if they were going to add any other stuff to the end or not. I do like that Vito is the only one that I know of that's in all three games. I know Leo Galante is in two and three, but I'm, I'm going to look up because I don't recall seeing or hearing about him in the first game as the original or the remake. Um, it'd be interesting to know, though, but I also don't remember meeting Salieri in prison or why that mission started out of, like, why we went to kill him. I know why, but I don't remember who we met where we were told to go kill, um, uh, fuck, Tommy. I'm trying to think all the names, but... I really, really did enjoy this. I suggest people go out and get it. The only sketchy things or weird things are once, like, uh, there was one mission that I was doing where the audio went out, and then the rest of the video, there was no audio. So then I had to go back and replay it. Um, also, the, um, the motorcycle one mission... Like, if you're driving a motorcycle, it is very strange on this game. And the crash physics are also pretty strange. But other than that, I think the game is great. And I'm so happy that it was remastered. And this is probably the fastest game that I ever beat. Um, just because I already knew all of the stuff. But it's the layout is better, I think, on here. Um, because when you're at the airport... And when you are at the um, the docks, those are two very like iconically difficult missions to do, but they weren't too bad on here. Um, I was thinking recently what I might do is go back to Mafia 2. I want to buy the um, the new remastered version of Mafia 2, and I want to play through that. But I also want to do um, Joe's Stories or whatever that was called, Joe's Tales, because I don't think I ever did that um, before, so I'll have to see about doing that. But that is going to be it for this episode, or this series, actually. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. And if you did enjoy the video, check out one of my previous, next, and related videos. And don't forget to check out my social medias in the description down below. <laughs>